abiertas todas las vías del diálogo. Las exclusiones en este momento no resuelven el problema. Y por eso es que en esta resolución en particular México se abstuvo. Eh, y vamos a seguir impulsando que esas investigaciones por parte de la Comisión Independiente del Consejo de Derechos Humanos, de la Corte Penal Internacional y de la Corte Internacional de Justicia se muevan con celeridad y nos lleguen los resultados para examinarlos y actuar en consecuencia. Esa es básicamente la posición de mi país. I think it creates more polarization. The, the numbers are, are very, very clear. Uh, but I hope uh, this will not be an additional obstacle for other uh, bodies of the UN, such as the Security Council and the General Assembly itself, to keep working. We need to find a diplomatic solution. So Mexico is in favor of everything that will keep inclusion and dialogue on the table because that's the only way we're going to find that diplomatic solution that we all want, but that unfortunately we don't see it yet. So uh, yeah, this is what, what we have and we have to deal with it. And I think uh, uh, this will not be a major obstacle. A decision has been made and uh, each one has to assume the consequences. Thank you. Yes,